Welcome back to today's post-apocalyptic world. In today's milestone video, we're actually going to raise the tail. So we've got all 40 of our vertebra printed, covered, and painted. And that happens in the other room where I've got eight Ender 3 Pro 3D printers going all the time, as well as putting them together, which we have in this video. But now we've got all 40 finished. Well, most of them, if you'll see, there's a few white ones there that kind of got lost in the shuffle because I gave a lot of tours around here and sometimes parts go missing. No, I'm just kidding, that was, that was a gift. And so what we've done recently is kind of raised our armature to 10 feet actually. That's how high the tail's going to be. And because looking further at the 3D model on the computer, it turns out that it's a little bit bigger than we thought it would be. And there's some good purposes to that because now, now that it's going to be raised, all these parts are gonna take zero space, right? Because this, they're going in space that's never being used anyway. So there's a lot of reasons to do today's video. And one of them is to make space for other parts coming in and kind of get rid of these 40 parts. Another part that I haven't talked about yet are what are called chevrons or chevrons. They are the parts of the vertebra that go underneath, that kind of extend out and make the tail bigger. And the reason we haven't started building those yet is that they are not critical to the overall size or design of the dinosaur. So for now, we're focusing on what the actual dinosaur is going to look like. And so those can always be built and put up afterwards, but that'll be fun. There's like 35 of them and they're gonna really bulk up and make the dinosaur look more like a T-Rex. So here we go, let's put this guy together and I'll try to do some time-lapse video for you and we'll see you on the flip side. that's all there is to it. Nobody fell, nobody got hurt. We can really start to see the scale of our dinosaur here. So it's 10 feet off the ground and about 22 feet long for now. And that's just the tail without the chevrons so far. So thank you for joining me on this impromptu video. And next time we will begin to put maybe the legs and the feet together now that we know kind of where they're going to sit. And we'll see you next time on Days Post-Apocalyptic World.